At the age of seven, Tony Green held the hand of a princess at the St. Anthony School Carnival pageant. Today, that same hand brings the spirit of carnival alive through the stroke of a paintbrush. Tony has a very interesting approach to Mardi Gras. He, he comes at it from a variety of perspectives. Having performed in Rex for more than 10 years and participated in several other parades, Tony Green not only celebrates the traditions, but he has a unique way of capturing carnival. All these little watercolors and drawings here were done on the spot. So I go down where the parade lines up at uh, Napoleon and Britannia around there. And I'm sort of like the action reporter mm -hmm. with my watercolors. And I'm right in the face of the flambeau and whatnot. And that way you capture the real excitement of what's going on. There's no substitute for honest observation. And that in-your-face style is how Green is able to vividly transfer so many Mardi Gras moments to canvas. All these large paintings here cover different aspects of Mardi Gras. We have the Proteus Ball. We have a second line going through Treme. We have, of course, the wonderful flambeaus, the Mardi Gras Indians. And then, you know, this is yet another faction of the community of New Orleans which celebrates Mardi Gras. It's the attention that Tony pays to Mardi Gras that's allowing his contemporary art to mix with history at the State Museum. Hopefully the exhibit will be used for educational purposes because I'd like to bring some kids in here, and, you know, some aspiring young painters and uh, give them a pep talk about what it takes to be a real artist.